Hi, this is Tara Platt. I am the voice of Edelgard and Tamari and even Yuri Watanabe and Spider-Man. And I'm Yuri Lowenthal, and you may know me as Peter Parker slash Spider-Man from uh, Sony's Insomniac's uh, Marvel Spider-Man game, uh, or Ben Tennyson from Ben 10, or Sasuke from Naruto. My name is Sasuke Uchiha, and I hate a lot of things, and I don't particularly like anything. What I have is not a dream, because I'm going to make it a reality. I'm going to restore my clan and kill a certain someone. Not fair. You just talked for like ten minutes. I know. That's I, the when side jutsu, and, and you watching are watching the, the boys, boys podcast. podcast. I'm in real trouble if he uses his shotgun gun. I've got to force him to waste a lot of his chakra and quickly. It's my only chance. Should I use the chidori and try to take her out quickly? Sure. Why not? I'm so sorry, Yuri. I should have been here. He knew exactly what he was doing. He went straight for the cases marked Project Olympus. Any idea what that is? No, but he has it now. And we'll get him. I know. Where are you going? To teach a lesson in fear. And welcome back to our episode of the Boys Podcast. Today is a very special episode as I'm joined by two people, two very talented people, both of whom have appeared on many TV shows, movies, and video games, some of which with one another. <clears throat> Tara Platt. She's been in projects such as Eldogard and Fire Emblem, T Tamari in Naruto, Yuri in the Spider-Man video games, alongside her husband, who is my other guest, Yuri Lowenthal. Yuri Lowenthal, you have seen him in projects such as Sasuke and Naruto, young teen Ben Tennyson and Ben Ten, and the Sp Spider-Man in the Spider-Man video games. So welcome the legends themselves, Tara Platt and Yuri Lowenthal. Welcome, guys. Thanks, Thank Joe, you. for for having us. Thanks for calling us legends. That was kind of <laughs> awesome. Yeah, you guys are awesome. Like in my opinion, like guys, you guys gotta check out all their roles. Like my childhood. Just saying. So, thank you. <laughs> so these questions, like Tara, you'll be a answering for. Okay, this is like different. So Tara, you'll be answering for Yuri. Yuri will be answering for Tara. Oh, I know. I hope uh, I get okay, that Okay, let's right. try. Let's okay. try. Okay. okay. Fire away. Enter. Okay. So if Yuri slash Tara won the lottery, how would they choose to spend their money? So how would Yuri spend his money? Yuri, how would Tara spend her money? He would donate it and give it away to everybody. And uh, Tara would uh, take a trip around the world or go to all the countries that she's never been to before. What countries, have, can I ask a side question, what countries have you ever been to? I'm curious. Uh, I've never been to China. Um, I've never been to Russia. I've never been to Greece or Turkey. Um, I don't, there's a lot of countries, so I don't know that I can list all the countries I've never been to. <laughs> It'd be a far shorter list to list all the countries I have been to, but that's okay. That's, that's for another time. Right. All right, um, what's your next question? Before that, too, like, what was your favorite country you visited? I'm just curious. Favorite country you've ever visited? Well, I very much like the UK, and I would have to say probably Ireland has a piece of my heart. Ireland. Nice. And I like that, too. Like you said, Yuri would donate it. I like that. Yeah. I like that's that. Husband. Now, uh, what career would Yuri slash Tara want to do if they didn't go into voice acting? He'd be a chef. Uh, correct. If I, could, if I could hack the kitchen. And... And I can't see you doing anything other than like telling stories, you know, acting, writing, um, maybe uh, like a yoga teacher or like a meditation teacher or, or okay, okay. Hi hypnotherapy, okay. like some sort of. Okay, I see where you're going with that. Sort of I was holistic, like, not a yoga uh, teacher, but yes, well, not, yeah. Not yeah, yoga, holistic, but like, more like, holistic. Yeah, meditation. Okay, yeah, okay. I see that. Mm -hmm. So, like, um, like that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Right, exactly. <laughs> now, well. <laughs> what would Tara slash Yuri go, would they rather go to the past or future or would they want to stay in the present? Oh man. Oh. That's a good question, um, Joe. Thank you. Would you rather go to the past, I think, the future, or stay in the present? I think you would want to go to the future. Yes, you know me well. Mm -hmm. I am trying to decide which of those three you'd rather go to because I know there's people that you love that are not here anymore that you would like to see again in the past. Mm -hmm. But I know you're so good at being in the present. Mm -hmm. But I know there's probably a part of you that would like want to see our kiddo grown up, so you'd mm -hmm. want to go to the future. So like they're all equally. All your needed. answers are correct. So I don't I don't know how to figure that, that out hard. for you. Yeah. Sorry. That's okay. I don't mean to let you down. He, he wants a, okay. a perfect time machine that he can go to any of them. Uh, so like a DeLorean. Do you want a DeLorean? Right. He wants right. to or, or a police box. Or a police box. Tardis. Yeah, a TARDIS. Mm -hmm. Ooh. So the doctor. Mm -hmm. yes. I like that. Who would Tara slash Yuri love to have dinner with? Like dead or alive? And who would it be like? Would it be like a singer, actor, actor anything? Uh, 
Oh, no. You like people so much. That's true. He's going to want a banquet with everybody. That's uh, true. Um, um, and, who, and who would you want to... Uh, me, you would want yeah, to. I would want to. <laughs> <laughs> but you, you like. I mean, you get that. I there's know, so but... many actors that you love so much, like mm-hmm. their work, that mm-hmm. you would want to have like a long dinner table with like the cast of Patriot and and That's everyone true. who's ever been in right. like a. Anything that I've liked. <laughs> yeah, like every kung fu movie person, and like right, I don't, right. I don't know how to pick the people. That's true. I do. You're, I do like a lot of people. I'm kind of a nerd. I'm a fanboy. Yeah, you're a fanboy. That's that's awesome. That's really cool. Now, <clears throat> if Yuri slash Tara had to create the soundtrack to their life, which three songs would be on there? Like, they had named their bands and ours. Like, oh, oh no, you like all the songs. Oh, how am I gonna decide? Well, that's you would true. either want John Williams to orchestrate mm-hmm. it for you, mm-hmm. or you point. would pick mm-hmm. like one song that Sagan loves. Mm-hmm. One song that's on your like writing song uh, list, mm-hmm. and then you would pick like a silly dance, like almost like the the rubber band, rubber, rubber band, band, rubber band sort of man, something. Yeah, yeah. Like because you like silly, or maybe Bollywood. I don't. I can't pick three for him. That's I don't right. know. He that's loves right. music. He always listens to music. Mm-hmm. I'm the one that works mm-hmm. in complete silence all day. That's true. Uh, um, the the sign. You would want the sign by yeah. uh, mm-hmm. uh, Eraser. No, oh, it's a base. It's a base. It's a base. Eraser. Right. Uh, you would want. But see, you know the names. I don't know the right. names of the songs. Because they're the ones you listen to. Um, you would want. Um, uh, what's the Concrete Blonde song? Uh, oh, I, I wake in the or morning. Or Three Non Blondes. Sorry, non-blondes. Three Non Blondes. Um, and you would want Three Simba for Stump and Dunk Oh, no, no. So. You would want that, but I don't want Catania. You would want the. Oh, that's true. You'd because want... you, that would make you think it's taken and you would laugh. That's true. You would, so you want... would want that piece and not to not do want... so. Right. You would want. Uh, uh, I guess your your entire your entire soundtrack would Might be, be Katsun Yama. Katsun, it's okay. a band called Katsun know. Yama, which is her favorite band. Yeah. And you mentioned John Williams. That's like an icon. I'm sorry, John. Right? Williams. Yeah. I mean, I mean, I mean, who wouldn't want John Williams to score me? <laughs> everything. Right. Okay. Besides you. Right. Right. Okay. Me. I would want that. I know. I know. And you know that. But so I don't want to score. I don't want a soundtrack. I just want to listen when I want to listen. This and is be good. Quiet. Joe's Joe's asking questions that, this is good. that, that I like allow being, us. Yeah. To, these are these are great. Questions. I like that we have to answer for each other. That's more exciting than just answering for ourselves. That's true. Thank you. Thank you. And is that someone you want to bring to your dinner then, John Williams? Oh. I, you know, I, I'm sure John Williams is a cool guy, but I don't know that I'd necessarily want to have dinner with him. You don't but, have but dinner, I, but I have the music. His, his music his playing music in, in my background. In background. Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's true. Now, if Yuri slash Tara had a movie made about them, who would they want to portray them? Like, like who would portray the like, Yuri Lowenthal movie? Who would portray Tara Platt in the movie? Who would... Oh, um, uh, who played Amelie? Uh, oh, I have uh, like What her. is her name? I can't remember, um, her name, but she's. Very I'll think of it in a second. The 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 actress, the French actress who played Amelie. Yeah, she's adorable. Uh, would um, play you. Uh, what is his and, name? He's in the Barbie movie, but that's not what he's known for. Oh, Ryan, Ryan, Ryan Gosling. Gosling. <laughs> okay, okay, Ryan Gosling and. Why can't I think of her name? Uh, you'll have to look that up. You can put it on screen later if you want. I don't to. remember what her name is. She's so cute. Oh, it's been a while since I've seen her I or something. I don't know. Uh, hmm. yes. So, so I think would be a good sure. I love that. Younger you? Yeah. Yeah. Or or Ryan Reynolds or Channing Tatum. Or could you could you just Chris, help... Chris Evans? Oh no, that's that's the movie. Oh no, I just listed all the, the all men the that I think are love. handsome. <laughs> <laughs> no, but that's what you do is each portion of your your the film it's played by a different actor playing you. Oh. So it's like it. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. Okay. That's okay. cool. That'd be cool. Well, almost on. like a biopic type of movie. Right? Yeah. Exactly. Now what would, now side question for that one? What would you call this biopic? With the two of you guys, Yuri and Tara, Tara and Yuri. You... Oh, we've come up with every now and then. I know, we'll say, we'll say a like funny thing, and we'll be like, our... "That's going to be the name of your." It your it's uh, usually memoir. when we're like out and about. Oh, terrifying yeah. is mine. Terra terrifying. Fine. Yeah. Um, wait, what was yours? Um, oh, but yours could be the man I mean, of a thousand faces, and you have different people playing you in every scene. That's true. Mm-hmm. Or um, dancing for myself. Yeah, that's true. That's, <laughs> that's true. That that sort of shows my dancing how, my myself. dancing. Yeah. yeah, dancing for myself and terrifying. <laughs> <laughs> now, what character like you guys voice like remind you of each other? Like, what character of Yuri's like reminds him of himself, and what character of Tara reminds her? Of? 
Mm. Well, I think Spider-Man Peter Parker reminds Yuri of him because he's such a good guy who wants to do good and wants to help other people. That's true. And believes in responsibility and believes in helping you help one person you help like he's basically mm-hmm. peter parker i mean mm-hmm. you are peter parker yeah i, I know you I want to be argue, captain america but you are peter parker that's true i i would argue that very few of your characters uh represent who you are yeah i don't uh, know if in real life. i do um but i would say of them i mean i think wonder woman uh, sort of embodies your strength hmm. and your, your sense of character that's true yeah thanks yeah so yeah, Wonder Woman, Spider Man dating. <laughs> I mean, we're like crossing. We're crossing. We're crossing DC weird. To Marvel. Yeah, it's yeah. okay. It's okay. Wow. Now, what is Yuri? What's your favorite terror role? And Tara, what's your favorite Yuri role? I mean, I loved it when you played Superman because he was mm. just. But I mean, that also embodies you. Like, right? You are naturally heroic. Like, you have mm. that in you. Mm-hmm. Even Ben is like a little hero. He's mm-hmm. just a brattier version of a hero right but um wait what was the question exactly was it your favorite role of the other person yeah but like so i know it's hard because like i would there's a part of me that would say what a lark oh yeah uh, for yeah. your and role megan. in megan and what a lark um, i mean i really loved your work in orbital thank you mm-hmm. yeah uh- Thank you. I checked, you told me you told me to check out. It was really good. I watched and yeah, oh great. yeah great 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 good good i'm glad uh I'm, but it's I'm also like that's it. where yeah. you are now do you know what I mean? Right. Like, because, because every time you do something, you're growing and you're changing and you're becoming more you as on, you age. On, so like, on one hand, I would say my favorite role of yours um, was from Model Chaser, which was the film we met on. Because if you hadn't played that role, that's true. But it's not a, like it's met. not a great role for me necessarily. No, I know. I but know. we did meet, so that that that's, was important. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. The chemistry was like instant, right there. It, it, it was. It was. Wow. I should post it. I should post it since it's not up anymore. I'm going to oh, ask, true. maybe I'll ask JC, uh, if, JC if I can just post it on, on, our, on our, YouTube. Our, our YouTube channel. Mm. Now, what is Tara slash Yuri's favorite movies and TV shows? That's not fair. <laughs> you like all of them. <laughs> I, I mean, like, literally, I could just... It, Start naming names. Star Wars, <laughs> Indiana Jones, mm-hmm. uh, the yeah. people who kill people in the woods. The whatever that uh, one is, uh, uh, no, no. Um, the people who kill people in the no, woods. No, they're like in the mob. It's from oh, like, uh, Miller's Crossing. Miller's Crossing. <laughs> yes. Um, yeah. Uh, 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 Princess Bride. Princess Bride. Yeah. The Imposters. The Imposters. Oh, the Imposters too for you. You like mm-hmm. Patriot, mm-hmm. and you like Shrinking, mm-hmm. and you like Ted Lasso, mm-hmm. but you also like uh, those other movies. Scary, the, scary, scary things uh, and dark The Purge things. and oh, Mad scary. Max. That's true. And um. I don't know those other ones mm-hmm. that you but, like, but I know you like uh, uh, Ted Lasso, Shrinking, I do also, like those too. and uh, and uh, 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 Poker Face. Oh yeah, that's fun too. Yeah, because it's mystery. I mm-hmm. like mystery. Mm-hmm. You guys mentioned Indiana Jones. Yuri, did I tell you I actually interviewed Karen Allen, Marion? No. Cool. Yes. That must have been so cool. It was. Oh my, she actually. Okay, so she might. I'm telling you this. She might make a little appearance in the movie. By the way. Just telling me, based on my interview with her, she told me. <laughs> so I hope she does. I hope she does. Yeah, me too. She does. Right. She she may have let something slip. <laughs> yeah, she's like she's like uh like you know what I mean. Yeah. Wow. Now, what is Tara slash Yuri's favorite food? Sushi, mm-hmm. both... peanut butter. And what do I make? Yuri curry. Yeah. That's yeah. Cool. Um. And for Tara, sushi, definitely. Um, and stew, like dinty more beef stew. Um, and, and. Candy. Candy, candy, that's right, that's true. Candy, candy. candy. <laughs> now, uh, Yuri, describe Tara in three words, and Tara, describe Yuri in three words. Three words. <laughs> mm-hmm. Independent. Um, okay, so I'm counting. Um, right, yeah, independent, loving, uh, courageous, heroic, kind, and thoughtful. Wow, I would say for both of you guys, like very caring, very helpful, very smart, very cool. 
I, I can't, like, so many words describe you. Three is hard, Thank man. You. Right, is right. Hard. Only picking three to, to describe, like, the whole of somebody is difficult. <laughs> now, uh, what advice would, what, like, in general, what advice would you guys give younger people who want to become a voice actor, voice actress? Like, what's your guys' advice? I mean, that's tricky because we wrote a book, so it's like all that in there is good information. Right. But, but if we had to, if we had to sort of distill it down to some things that that anybody could could start doing, like as soon as they finish watching your show, um, uh, we always well, talk about reading aloud. Yeah, and you all, you always tell people like to make sure that you really enjoy it. So like, do improv yeah. or get into a play. Like, make mm -hmm. sure that acting is enjoyable it's, it's, to you that you're not you just love. doing it because you want to be in an anime or something like that. right because yeah because it'll th there'll be so many times where you're not getting paid wait are we uh, still answering for, for each other or are we just answering this question no i, I think we're both oh, i think we're okay. both just sort of answering this because uh, i know we, we share a lot of the same views as far um, as that's concerned um yeah make sure you you love acting and so by you know to, to do that you'll just have to try a bunch of you know acting taking classes and doing plays and Making stuff with your friends. And, but the and reading aloud is a good one, too. Reading aloud every day mm -hmm. uh, is a big deal. And and making things. Yeah, make stuff. Make, make sure that Make your own stuff. Yeah. yeah. Be relentless. Um, finish things. Finish people, things. People, people respect it when you say you're going to do something, and then you do it, and you finish yeah, it, and, follow you, and through. you go to the next thing. Because it doesn't have thing. to be perfect, because perfect is the enemy of, of done. done. And but done is done, the enemy of more. Well, oh, so wait, no, done is the engine of more. Engine of more. Sorry. But, but, done, a good and, what is the phrase? It's, um, good, good enough. Is, good, good is good, is good enough. Good is good enough. Like, get it, getting it done is more important than mm -hmm. getting it right. So if you complete it and you finish it, then you mm -hmm. can move forward and learn from it. Mm -hmm. But if you're always in the process of trying to get it right, then you never Perfect, actually... Yeah learn and you don't move forward and that's because you can is. never get it right right your perfect. growth your growth is in the moving forward rather than in the perfectioning the perfection of it or the completion mm -hmm. in that way perfection mm -hmm. so the completing it is the more important part of the process mm -hmm. oh, i always like to like stay humble remember you came from that's why it's like that's my advice always yeah, yeah although i, I almost feel one. like people that are dedicated to the working of it are the humble people. <laughs> like it's if sort of like if you're in it for different reasons. Yeah, if you're that's in it for when the, the fame or the happens. money. Then then it start, Then you start to get away from the yeah. humility. I think because that's that's, that's what you're you're chasing those dragons mm -hmm. as opposed to chasing your better mm -hmm. creative self, which is you can't not be humble because you'll never get to that better creative self until you've gotten there. <laughs> like it, you're always chasing mm -hmm. that, so you have to be humble because you're not at that state mm -hmm. yet. Mm -hmm like that. Now, before I ask you guys my last question, actually, do you guys have any questions? Um, I like that you came you... up with these questions. They're real yeah, cool. Where did you yeah. come up with them? I know. They're, 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 I, feel, I feel it'd be like different, you know, like from like different perspectives, you know? Uh, I love it. Yeah, it's really fun to also, we've both done a lot of interviews, some mm -hmm. together, some separate, mm -hmm. but they almost always ask the very same questions and you get a little tired because you're like, I've, I've answered this question like a hundred times. So if you do have, you search, I've, I'm, I'm saying the same answer, but this was kind of cool because I had to answer for you, uh -huh. which made me like think about how you would say things. Here's here's a question for you, Joe. What's what's your dream? What's your ultimate? I know, and you know, things, the, the dreams can change and dreams can morph, but what is right now what is what do you want to do? What do you really want to do? As of May fifth, twenty twenty three. Yes, I want to make on May sixth. It might be different, <laughs> but today, what is? I want. Thing? I want to become like a director, screenwriter, oh. director. I love. I'm telling you guys, I love to write scripts. That's my mm -hmm. thing. Right. Like that's my main hobby. I, I love to write scripts, and maybe one day I could work with the two legends right here. You know. Yeah. That would be amazing. I would shoot higher, but yes, <laughs> yes, that would be amazing. Um, shoot for the awesome. stars, you might land on the moon. That's yeah. right. That's right. Um, and I guess my last question is: Can can yeah? Can you uh, pull down that uh, the the collage you made? Because now sure. I'm I, and, and bring it a little closer. Although it looks like he's got it is, balanced. I don't. Oh, want oh, it to oh yeah, Ben Ten, Ben Tennyson is balanced on the top. So you can always you can always say, you know send uh, email us a. Uh, I could it. Like, if you guys like, actually, off podcast, like when I'm done recording. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's oh, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good, good plan. Any other questions you guys got? Mm -mm. Just what is your last question? I think yeah. before I ask, I'm sorry. I have like a I forgot my little side question. Would you guys be willing in the future, whenever you guys are available, for like another 20 minute, like a fan question, like any like like almost like this fan questions? I'm sure we could do that. Yeah. Yeah. 
Awesome. Now, uh, is there anything you guys would like to promote and shout out for my viewers to check up for you guys? Anything you guys out? Uh, um, I mean, you know, new new Spider Man game coming in the fall for from my side, and whip uh, whip. whip and... Um, oh, I like it if people read my book. Mm -hmm. so I know it came out in the fall, but That's yeah, prep like school, it what is it called? it's called Prep School for Serial Killers. Mm -hmm. um, you can, uh, as you you know, we mentioned before, you can watch Orbital Redux um, on Dust. Uh, both of us are, are on that. Uh, it's on YouTube, and we have we have a couple of shows. Uh, both What a Lark. Oh yeah. And uh, like, uh, web, the web series that the Terra created, and uh, Shelf Life. Yeah. Which and is even a up, up and away, our travel series. Up up and away. If if you miss travel, if you like travel, yeah. Um, and you it's can. It's us being silly as we're traveling around. Yeah, and you can uh, you can you can watch all those on our, our YouTube channels. Yep. Do you guys? Do you remember? Shelf, I think you mentioned the last time you're Shelf Life too. That's the thing. Yeah. Yeah. Shelf Life is I I still even though it's been years now since we created it and put it out there. I believe uh, it, there's still uh, there's still an audience for it that that wants to find it. It's glorious. I love it. It's still one of my favorite things that we've ever done. I like that. Thank you again, Tara and Yuri, for being awesome, amazing guests. I had a fun time chatting with you, two legends. Thank you. Thank You're you. so welcome. Thank you for having us, Joe. Yeah. Have a great day, everybody, and stay awesome. And you guys, stay awesome. Okay. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Too. If you're to wear like a Spider-Man shirt too, like I want to be like my uh, fellow Spider-Man, you know? Sure. Like the Spider-Man pointing me, you know? <laughs> Is that <laughs> the meme?